The worst thing for creative people is to not be creative because they just die. Maybe you're a tree with a few major branches, you know? That's your personality. So if you're extroverted, man, you can't be cut off from people because you just wither. And if you're agreeable, you have to be in an intimate relationship or you die, you know? And if you're conscientious, man, and, you, and you're unemployed, you're just going to eat yourself up because you have to have a duty and you have to carry a load because you just can't stand it otherwise. And open people have to be creative. They have to be because otherwise they die. They don't have any vitality. And so they're cursed with the necessity of putting a foot out into the unknown and making sense of it. And then they're also cursed with the necessity of trying to make a living while they're doing that, which they can't because you can't. It's almost impossible to monetize creative action, as many of you who are creative will no doubt find out. It's a beautiful morning The sky is black as in City's sleeping still And soon they'll wake up to the stink And soon they'll wake up to the stink Of life passing them by Wake up and smell the stink of their lives The garbage trucks are coming Take your shit to the dump Smelling pretty now Such a pretty little lump A pretty little lump of flesh Who's lost your way Another night, another day perfect creative environment. I could just sit down, bang out an article, set up a podcast, produce anything I wanted at any time. There was nothing else sitting in the back of my head. That home has been shaken, okay? And it is my duty to explain to you how it happened, why it happened, and what I'm going to do to fix it, if I can fix it at all. There is a huge reason why all my content shifted all of a sudden into this frenzy. And I'm sorry it's taken me so long to explain all of it to you in detail. I felt it was necessary because there are no secrets anymore. You can't run from anything. Right? This is a world where anything can be identified at any time, any place. So if you veer off course and you try to explain something in a different way, you try to hide something, you try to cover something up, chances are it's going to get brought to light. A lot of people say I should just keep my mouth shut. A lot of people aren't me. Whatever your opinion is of this next article, I'm perfectly fine with it. Everybody who's uh, chipped in and helped out with the whole process, whether you were in the videos, you were part of the podcasts, you were a collaborator, Thank you. You've helped a lot. You've given me something to do for the past three years. Let's hope for three more. Enjoy the view. You sleep at night, dreaming of the pretty things. Don't be too surprised when the telephone rings.